Hopefully you like that that cobblestone house. Until later, until I get some sheep to bring over here so we can act. Stop running away from me. Will you look at me? Hello everyone, it's I Shiny Guy here and welcome back to episode 7 of Minecraft Survival 1.14 Let's Play. Every time I do this intro, I always mix up some words and change them around and everything. I know it's not exactly on point with the wording and everything. And today, we got something special. Hopefully, uh, the bug that in a previous episode that there was no hostile mob spawning. And right now, as you can see, it's becoming nighttime. And hopefully, there will be some hostile mobs. And yeah, because I need to do some stuff with hostile mobs. And anyway, um, there's some things I want to do specifically with this place. Is that I want to set up a like cobblestone generator or something like that. Or basically, get a lot of cobblestone, build enough houses for these certificates. Because first of all, there's not really much for them to live. And they're kind of a bit crazy. Look at them. They just... Standing outside, like, is perfectly okay, but it's not because they're going to die if they stay out here. And I saw a testificate that went all the way over here. I did chop some wood down before I started recording this. It's right over here, and he's just trapped alone down there. I don't know what's going on, but can I at least have some mob spawning for once? But it looks like... I'm not getting any mob spawning, so it may be just a 1.14.3 bug that I don't know. Wait, is that like... Okay, that's just his cactus. I don't know what's going on. I'm not playing on peaceful, everyone. You can see my setting option is normal. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to play on peaceful for quick and change it to normal. Hopefully this fixes the issue. If not, I really don't know what's going on with the hostile mobs not spawning. Because this is one of the most annoying bugs of all, is that I don't have any mob spawning. This is kind of a bit ridiculous because I need hostile mobs in the first of all. I'm really surprised they're not spawning whatsoever. I think this is also night three where I haven't slept at all. And I'm supposed to see phantoms as well, but there are no phantoms. So, I really don't know what's going on, but what I will do today is that I'm probably going on a mining adventure, basically to get more cobblestone, so I can start building these amazing testificate uh, buildings for them, or villagers, or whatever. Okay, so, I thought about building a place for the villager, but I have to also make sure that villagers do not enter the place of whether I'm building this stupid uh, mine place and what I'm gonna do is I'm probably gonna build like a oh that's one cool thing I didn't know you can actually do strips you can strip the wood to make a strip log or whatever let's make a trap door and I'm thinking that we should build it like close to our base like I'm thinking we can just put it like maybe back here just because you like, oh, we have a trap door right here. Let's go to my secret base. <laughs> and that's my logic of like, hey, let's just build one right here. But since we have, the problem I'm going to have right now is that I'm going to need a lot of ladders and everything. So, can I not place that sand? I'm going to build a lot of ladders real quick. Because I will need some ladders to at least get down and up. And I'm just going to keep it nighttime until hopefully I get some phantom spawning around here. I hope my world doesn't, it's not glitched to the point where hostile mobs are not spawning. Because if a hostile mobs are not spawning, I'm going to have a really big issue. I can't get enderman for the ender pearls. And you know I need ender pearls to basically make, yeah, make some of the sweet sweet and I have been uh, to find the end store uh, in storage but uh, whatever that place called uh, I don't remember what was the name of it and I'm looking for something cobblestone that's what I'm looking for okay let's do this I don't know how far I want to do it down go straight down so I'm gonna mine all of this it's gonna take a while so I'm probably just gonna cut to the point until to my hit my cave 
but it doesn't really matter because I'm still going to basically build my way out. Oh, what I could do really, this might be a good idea, is that I maybe have a quick access down here, but I realize I can use water to get back and up and down. But ladders like a lot more. I like using ladders. And let's keep going up. And let's put a trap door here. Can I actually? Oh, look at that trap door. And basically make it look nice. And that's not gonna look nice at all. So one, one thing I should do is that I have a ladder to get back up. And maybe I should have a quick drop down here. But I don't know how I'm gonna do that just because I want to do a quick drop down. I'm gonna have to like make sure I don't die in the process of dropping down here. I really don't know why mobs are not spawning. It's really starting to concern me a bit. Oh, there's a cave down here. Sorry if you guys cannot see that. But let's go back and grab some torches and let's probably explore that cave. Maybe. Just maybe. We get some hostile mobs. And maybe it's just a bug. But I'm not gonna say it's 100% a bug right now because we don't know if it's a bug. And I don't wanna like jump to the conclusion that, oh, it's just a bug, everyone. It's just no hostile mob spawning. And uh,. Yeah, but it should be spawning because last time I saw a when I was clean up everything It was Hostile mobs was spawning And of course there's nothing down here sadly I was so hyped for a really good adventure down here, but I came down to like Yeah, there's nothing down here sadly. This is one of the crappiest cave of all I'm thinking of going pretty far down to the mines so maybe I just stop right here and basically build like a little pathway going down this way so this is going to take some time because I have to do the second process of going straight down to the mine and to the correct Y level yeah that's going to take a long time but yep and we come across a cave of things to do here possibly hopefully I don't know but I'm running out of my pickaxe as well but I need always need to grab my coal because you know why I need to grab coal because all of you viewers out there say like please use torture so we can see as well I can understand that why you all want me to do torches as well because mainly the light I can because I my friend was over here like a couple of days ago, and when I was watching his screen when we were playing Minecraft together of like a horror map, it was super dark for him, and I noticed that I know like not every monitor will be the same because some monitors are like super like dim, some monitors are super bright, and for me. I don't know why, but I can see perfectly fine. It's, I've always been able to see perfectly fine. I think because the reason why I'm using, and maybe it between like an IPS panel and a TN panel. I do have both because I'm playing on an IPS panel right now. And I can see clearly, like, even in the darkness. But I have an ITN panel to my, for like I use for like, whatever second monitor for like doing everything. And I can barely see it during the darkness. If I have another uh, monitor that's, I think it's an IPS pack because it's, my brother used it for like doing video editing, and, not video editing, but Photoshop stuff. So it basically has really good perfect colors. And he was able to see like everything. My friend was able to see everything clearly using that monitor. But no, now it's like, so I think it's a TM panel thing where it's like everything super dark. And I think that's how it is. Why do I not see any mobs? This is starting to annoy me. 
I know there's a lot of things I need to mine down here, but I'm more concerned like finding mobs. I want to um find some mobs and basically Yeah. I will grab some iron more iron. Uh, coal? Let's grab some coal. Okay, I got my diamond pickaxe now and we're gonna head back down again. Why? A mob's not spawning at 1.14.3. I might have to revert back to 1.14.2 and I have to deal with a horse bug. Because this is really, 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 really ridiculous. And I don't want to deal with that. I'm not even joking with all of you, all of you all. Because as much as I like a more like peaceful mood, but I can't do half of the things on what I need to do in Minecraft. And if I can't do half of the things I need to do in Minecraft, what's the point of playing Minecraft? But I'm doing mining and crafting. It's just like I really, really need to grab the fix this issue. I may, if this could, if this bug per, uh, persists and so on, I may have to send in a report to Mojang or a bug report, and hopefully they fix it quickly. Because if they don't fix it, it kind of ruins my Minecraft experience. Because the whole sole purpose I do this whole let's play is to go from like the start to finish, get from like. Basically, start off like a fresh new world and then go all the way to the end and basically do beat the ender dragon. And after that, I beat the wither boss. Basically, hopefully, get an elytra and start flying around and everything. That's my sole purpose of this whole let's play. I'm not really getting that. Like, if I were to play on peace from I would let's just play on creative mode just to do building and everything like build challenges or whatever I want to do. It's so peaceful, everyone. Sorry if this is going to be like probably the most boring episode you will watch. Just because, first of all, you all know what I'm experiencing right now. No hostile mob spawning. And if you, if any of you know about this bug, or like even though I'm probably in the wrong biome or having an explanation for this, please let me know in the comments because I, I really want to fix this. Because right now I can't do half of the things I need to do. I need to kill Enderman for the Ender pearls. And I need to kill some skeletons, it's not, well mainly skeletons for arrows, because that's a good source of arrows actually. What can I do to fix this? That's the thing. All because I'm in a sand biome that hostile mobs don't really spawn. I don't know what's going on. Please let me know in the comments if you understand what's going on here. I don't know what's going on. And that's just been bugging me for the past few days actually. Oh my god. I just want this bug to be fixed. So I don't have to worry about it. <laughs> and I want to keep this, these uh, Let's Play episodes more interesting for you all to watch. But right now I'm kind of like doing mining and I should be doing mining off camera. But since I don't really have any specific things to say or whatever, or like a specific task I want to do like raiding that pillager and possibly kill some pillagers and see how tough they are. I, I, I can't do that just because... I don't have hostile mob spawning. Maybe it's just a biome thing, but it shouldn't be a biome thing. That's, a, that's what I'm trying to figure out. As you may notice with throughout my all my of episodes so far of the Let's Play Minecraft series, I do cut out a lot of boring parts mainly. I do record like roughly an hour, but I usually try to chop it down all the way to like at least 20 minutes, which is the ultimate goal. That's what someone told me to do. I usually try to go for 30 to 40, but some people get, they said like, they kind of, some viewers will like, not like that. But there's some reasons why I do that. But sometimes I kind of want to keep it that long. Just keep it interesting. But most of the time it's just boring part. So right now I kind of change my ways of editing it. Try to reduce it all the way to 20 minutes. At least 20 to 30 minutes is what I'm trying to aim for. Per episode. And that's what I'm going to do. Whoa, what does this lead to? To the surface by the looks of it. Okay, it's nighttime again. I don't know. I really don't know. I think the only thing I can do is enable land and make sure hostile mobs do spawn. 
Because I know there's a certain setting that you can disable hostile mod. It may possibly be that issue when I update to 1.14.3. It causes an issue that, hey, this is, my, this is an accidental issue that we implemented in Mojang, like, into the game. And I think that's probably what it is, because mobs still, hostile mobs are still not spawning. And I'm in my normal difficulty. It's like so concerning that I can't do anything about that. So, hmm. Okay, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go into land real quick and see how to. F I think there's a way to. I think it's probably disabled as soon as I update it to 1.14.3 because. Ever since I did that, Bob stopped spawning. I don't want to revert back to 1.14.2 and then have to deal with all of that. So, yeah. See, I don't know what would it be under though because I never actually encountered this before. Maybe game rules. It might be a game rule thing. Uh, do mob spawning. We should set it to true. Anything out of that? It's now set to. It's now set to true, so mobs should spawn now. I really don't know what to do. It might be just an actual 1.14.3 bug where hostile mobs just don't spawn whatsoever. Hmm. How about this? There's another way to test it too, but oh, there's pumpkins there. I'm in the actual like regular biome now, so like maybe it just might be the sand biome. And I might keep exploring around here. Hopefully I can find something. Uh, can, can. I'm surprised I don't kill one-shot sheeps. Oh, I do. I didn't mean to hit it with my pickaxe. I don't know. I may have to revert back to 1.14.2, but also that's the problem. I revert back everything I did as well. I can't revert. Can I revert back to 1.14.2 and not lose anything I have in 1.14.3? Like anything to this map? That's what I'm concerned about right now. Because this is still ridiculous that I have this issue. And mobs are still not spawning. I really don't know everyone. I... I... I can't... I, I don't really know how to fix this issue. I did a game rule of like, do mob spawning is set to true, which is now untrue, which mobs supposed to spawn now. And that's what I want them to spawn. So in the meantime, hi villager, how are you doing today? Do you have twenty? Oh yeah, you're just good to rip off one. So probably what I'm gonna do now is probably set up some houses and stuff for the villagers with cobblestone. And what kind of house I'm building, I really don't know. Maybe some simple house uh, building for like for the villagers and everything. Enough for them to like rush like, hey, this is a building that you can sleep in. And then basically, um, I have a problem. This is not equal. No, let's have it like right here for the door instead of right there. And let's finish this house off by putting more of this and then put a torch on top so that it'll spawn on the top. Break this. I don't know why I'm using my diamond pickaxe. And all we have to do after that is all you need to do is put a door down. And they will rush this like this should be a place that they can stay in. See, that's all. Now, it's a building. It's not too fancy, but I can make it fancy and everything. Which, I probably will do that for these villagers so they can actually have a place to sleep. Maybe make it look comfy in there. I don't know why I put a torch down, but that's pretty much my goal. It's just like kind of build like something like simple cobblestone boxes house for them, and maybe I can convert this entire village. And basically, I may do wood houses and stuff. I may just do a combination of this or whatever. I don't know what I want to do, but it's gonna be like crappy houses and everything. That's pretty much what I'm going for. Hopefully, you enjoy your new house right there. Yeah, no bed yet. You don't have any fun any furniture in there. Hopefully you like that that cobblestone house. Until 
later and try to get some sheep to bring over here so we can act. Stop running away from me. Will you look at me? Basically, I will get you your furniture, your bed, probably like a pot. But first thing first, I need to get some sheaves first. So I can shear the wool and make a bunch of beds and everything. So y'all can sleep for the night. You don't have to worry about like getting attacked by hostile mobs. But apparently, there are no hostile mobs yet for some reason. Because I'm dealing with a bug. And you stop looking away from me like you don't even care. Hey, you gotta look at me, okay? I don't want to punch you. Because you'll get angry at me for punching you. But, yeah. Hopefully you enjoy your house now. Oh look, you're running away from your job here? How? Okay. That's all I have time for today, everyone. Thank you for watching this episode. If you like watching this so far, consider subscribing for more content like this. And ring that bell so you get notified when I upload new videos. And also, when you ring that bell, make sure you set your notification to all so you get notified every single time I upload a new video. If you don't set it to all, sometime YouTube just don't really send out new videos to you all. Um, I really hate that. And I don't want you to miss a single episode that I upload these Let's Plays and other Minecraft videos that I play in the future. Leave a like, because it's still annoying bug that Mojang needs to fix. And I said I was going to do a specific task today, but I got caught up with like the hostile mobs and ranting about why hostile mobs and everything. And if you know the how to fix this bug, please let me know in the comments because I need to fix this. If this can't get fixed, I can't get hostile mobs. And I can't get the stuff that I need from the mob drops. Mainly, Enderman for Ender Pearls. I don't know any other ways to get it besides possibly trading and something like that. And stop pushing me around, you, you, you stupid villager. Thank you for watching everyone again, and I will see you all next time. Can they fix the stupid... Ugh.